Hey guys, Dozer Fat here with a little tutorial on how to overclock your ATI graphics card. Now, I'm not entirely sure if this will work for NVIDIA because I just got a new ATI graphics card about a week ago and um, that's why this video has been delayed a little bit because I've been waiting for my graphics card to come from Newegg. So, since I got it now, um, I have overclocked it already using MSI Afterburner and this is the program we will be using today. Now. I'll go ahead and put the link in the description for the download. So once you have everything installed, go ahead and double click on MSI Afterburner. And if it asks you for uh, permissions, click, go ahead and click yes and make sure you are an administrator of the system you're, uh, you are trying to overclock. Now this should work with NVIDIA cards, I'm pretty sure. It's pretty much the same thing. So you can see I have the ATI rate right on HD5450. Um, you can go ahead and mess with all these things. These three or these two will probably be uh, grayed out for you. I don't know why they're grayed out for me, but I'll go ahead and reset mine to the defaults. You can see I have a 650 megahertz core clock default and a 667 memory clock uh, megahertz default. So, depending on how safe you feel by uh, overclocking, do this at your own risk, of course. But uh, I usually like to go up by increments of 30. But for this, uh, I've been running at about 692 megahertz from 650 stock and memory clock. I usually like to make mine about 706. Now, if you do not want to apply your overclocking settings right away, go ahead and click Apply Overclocking at System Startup, and this little light will uh, turn on here. But if you want to, uh, if you want to apply the settings right away, go ahead and uncheck that, and then click Apply. You can see that. Um, it is now overclocked your graphics card just like that. But make sure you have good ventilation, of course, because this will make your graphics card give off more heat. Um, so go ahead. You can also download MSI Combustor. This is a good program to uh, test your to test your configuration settings that you've just set. So you can see here, it might be a little laggy for you because I'm using Camtasia. You can see that I did overclock it to 682 megahertz and the memory clock is at 706 megahertz. You can see that I'm getting about a 39 FPS average and um, it's actually running pretty good here um, under pretty much full stress and I'm getting about 36 FPS when I used to get about 30 non-overclocked. So you guys can go ahead and mess with all that junk if you want to. But this is just a little tutorial on how to overclock your graphics card with MSI Afterburner. Go ahead and stay tuned to my channel for more tutorials coming in the future. And uh, go ahead and check out my website. I'll put that in the description as well. And I'll see you guys later.